Well, taping is almost done. One more wet sand tomorrow, and then we paint. I covered up my water system just so I don't get it all full of dust. So I'm still not sure how I'm gonna lay out these racks. So, but the, that wall should have three rows of uh, 20 longs, five on a row. And on this wall here, I'm gonna, I think I'll have room for 15 10, 10 gallon tanks the, the, the long ways. And then I'd be just walking into the fish room. It's very dusty in here on the floor. But, um, trying to keep up with the fish doing all the work. Fish are doing good, did water changes the other day. Have a lot of young juveniles available. I have a new line of blues besides my original line. These look like they have a little more blue on the body. These are young. These will be available in about two weeks. You can see the blue on the body. Uh, and these fish are only uh, six weeks old. They're gonna be big. What's left of my half black greens until my uh, fry mature. Uh, these are my full reds. They should be available in about three or four weeks. Some young half black AOC uh, leopards. These are across from uh, my purple leopards and my regular leopards. F black reds are available now. Getting more caudal size on them. These are nice fish, really nice. It's really fulfilling when I see uh, hard work pay off after a couple of generations of selective breeding. This is a line I made from the half black white leopards cross to my purple leopards. Trying to get them lavender leopards again. But these are nice. They're also very young. This is what's left of my blues for now. My regular half black leopards. These are a dark line. These are um, the Moscow bicolors, AOC bicolors, whatever. They're more of a blue-green bicolor. There's some young Schubel greens. The problem is I run out of females before I run out of males. I just threw away or discarded two tanks of Schubel males had no more females. They were about seven months old. And, but no shows, no place to put them and I needed the tank space. I probably would have held on to them had I been, had the expansion been finished because I would have had at least 40 more tanks. But it is what it is. These are some half black white leopards, but uh, I'm not selling these. I sold a lot of them already. Only have a few females in that basket I'm gonna use, and these are another tank of my white leopards. I'm just waiting for these females uh, to give me at least one drop. Another tank of half black greens. A little too old for what I usually sell. We have up here, we have cobras up here. AOC bicolors, cobras. These are my American greens. It's 
totally different than a shovel ring. See, here's those silver blues again. I have one male in here that has no markings in the body other than blue. Let's see if he comes forward. There's most blues or American strains of a gray bodied guppies will, will have a red splatter of color in the body. But I have one male, there he is. That one right there has no red at all. Mostly your Splash of dark blue on the body. Oh, I just noticed there's an. Oh no, no, he's got some red. I don't know if you can see the difference. These aren't available. I'll make these available once I pick my own breeders. Probably won't be selling any of the males that have the the all silver body with the blue. some young half black yellow leopards. These are those non-cobra cobras. Limited amount of half black blues. But those aren't half black blues, I'm sorry. These are the half black blues. The tank before it is an experiment I'm working on, so they're not available. These are. These are not. <laughs> Sorry, I shouldn't show anybody these. It's an experiment. I got some young variegated snake skins coming up. Much better than the last two generations, but I stuck with them. I almost quit on them. But I finally, this is the third generation. And um, I'm getting um, mostly green, yellowish green variegated snake skins. But I do have a couple that look like they're coming up with gold bodies. I have a couple gold bodied females in the basket. I don't know if you can see them. There's a gold female. There's another, there's two females. So I might take these in another direction because I noticed on one of my drops, the gold uh, variegated snakeskin males have a thicker body. They were, last generation, they were very tiny. These are nice size now. There's some more half black blues here. Uh, I think my wife called me for dinner, so I'm going to end this video a little shorter than I usually do. There's some nice AOC bicolor cobras. Some very young half black leopards. Another tank of my greens. Have a lot of purples coming up. Everybody's been asking for them. We got a lot of young purples. They should be ready in about three or four weeks. There's some young half black purples. They're not available yet. Some more half black AOCs. These are my regular yellow leopards. There's those uh, variegated snake skins. This is coming up really nice. Like I said, I almost quit on these. I was getting a little frustrated with them. I wasn't getting uh, females. I was getting all males. Now I'm getting uh, about 50-50 split males and females. So that's about it. As you can see, I got lots of babies. Lots of babies. I got my full red albinos set up as breeders. This is what's left of them. These are young. I'm just hoping to get some fry out of them. I 
I got my blues I set up recently, waiting for them to have babies. Half black purples. Half black reds are very prolific this year. And my purples are very prolific. I mean, I didn't even take this drop of babies from the other day. I have no place to put them. You, know, you see all these containers? These are all half gallon containers. All with babies, because I have no tanks for them. I just cleaned three tanks today. Threw away three tanks, two of uh, shovel greens and one of uh, blues, just to make room. They were just seven or eight month old fish. I ran out of females. No point in keeping them, no shows available. And just to feed them and look at them is no, not thrilling for me. Unless there was a show going on. And there's some more fry, 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 fry. Yeah, maybe you can see the snake skins a little bit better here. This was one small drop of snake skins. I think I got three males and two females, or two males and three females. But um, these were born January 1st, so they're just a month old. This is gonna be nice. Very nice. A lot of babies, lots of babies. All right, well, that's the end of this video. I'm going to go eat. So, hopefully by next week, uh, I'll be building the racks. This is going to be an auto system. Uh, it'll automatically fill. I'm going to drill all my tanks. And um, once I get it going, I'll definitely feature a video of uh, the system online. All right, my wife's banging on the door. Time to go eat.